Good afternoon, everyone. I want to thank each and every one of you for being here today. You know, there's a lot of stuff that goes on in this state, but what we are going through right now is one that I'm not very happy of. Mm-hmm. I'm a proud Arizonan. I'm proud of what my abuelos did to bring my father to this country. My father came to this country when he was 12 years old. And he has raised us proud to be from this country and to live in this great state. But how we are here and how we are looked upon, not while I'm dressed in a suit and not while I walk as a leader of the House of Representatives or the 12 years that I've been a legislator. But when I'm not in this suit and when I'm walking the streets as just a regular person with brown skin or as a youngster or when my dad during SB 1070 driving his truck and being pulled over and being on the side of the road for 45 minutes and being questioned just because of his brown skin. That's not right. We can't stand for that. There's been too much hate brought into this country and into this state. And we shouldn't be standing for that. I was not that person that was brought up that are are wanting to be in these chambers here. But when I was asked to run for office, SB 1070 was the reason I wanted to. I wanted to come here to make a change because I was not willing to stand for what happened to my dad and to others of my community that I've been raised in my whole life. And I, I, I'll be damned if somebody's gonna look at me. I'm no different than anyone else. I'm born and raised here. Yes, my dad came here when he was 12 years old, but he's an American citizen now. And he loves this country just like everyone else does. We all have that right. That's right. This, this land was made by immigrants. Todos somos humanos. Let's start loving each other that way. Let's stop the hate. Let's, stop work. Let's start working together. We talk about that every day in these chambers. I've served in both of these chambers. And we talk about it all the time, even across the aisle. All right, babe. Let's stop just talking about it and let's start doing it. And I say that to my friends across the aisle and I still call them my friends. Let's stop talking and start working. I'm not one here to not, not willing to work with people. I will work. But this legislation that's before us today is not getting us there. Come to us, we're willing to work. And I, I, can st- I can pretty much stand here today with all my members here that are from the Senate, from the House. We're willing to work and we're willing to compromise. That's what this is all about, is compromising. But let's come together and get that done for the betterment of this growing state. And that's where we should be right now. Legislation is bringing hate to this state won't, is not going forward. We have too many people here from all over the world. But you know what? The biggest place that we have them coming from is from our biggest neighbor, de mi lindo Mexico. And I'll never forget where my raices come from and where, my, where I'm proud, where my dad and my abuelos and my familia comes from. And I'm still proud that yes, I'm here and I love my country, but I'm still very damn proud of my raises. Thank you very much.